I like doing things properly, but I'm out of time and I still have to dispose of them. Valerie got short shrift, but all in all, it was a very good night. Starting this morning, we have cadets from the academy going over every inch of the salvage yard. Those days, I don't miss. The kid we found yesterday saw someone abduct Valerie Castillo from that yard. Because he didn't recognize a photo of Jorge Castillo, Lieutenant LaGuerta is bringing him in to attempt a sketch. Meanwhile, we'll follow up on the DEA list of M99 buyers. That would include vets, doctors, uh, animal control, even circuses. Be thorough. Check everyone. Masuka. What do we have on the home and the boat? Uh, still processing, sir. If it turns out that the husband's a dead end, then we're looking at a new suspect, folks. Morgan, any ideas? Don't do it, Deb. The last thing I need right now is to be profiled for all of Miami Metro. We could be looking at someone who's inspired by the ice truck killer, a copycat. If so, the suspect is probably familiar with the forensic procedures. I have a profile I've been working on. I'd be happy to show it to you. I'll be in my lab. Hello, Tex. I have to know. Tex, sir. Oh, thank God. My arm's asleep. How long have you two been like this? That age, when they're out, they're out. He brush his teeth and he wouldn't wake up. Here, lift up his head, I'll slide this underneath. Some lab work, I had some time to kill. Okay. We didn't get very far, he's so tired. We're gonna pick it up again tomorrow. It's only a matter of time before we know what this little guy saw. That kid, Oscar, swears this is who he saw. Son of a bitch. Dex. OK, I gave them Jorge's sock, a knife with his prints, and a drop of his wife's blood. Forensics trifecta like that should trump a child's drawing. I hope. Jesus Christ saved this kid on his own for as long as Oscar was? Who's to say he didn't? Harry taught me to lie and keep my darkest secrets from those around me, which is why I need to make sure there's not a trace of blood left on my boat. He also taught me not to rush to judgment. Things aren't always what they appear to be including Harry. And what about me? Am I the twisted Bay Harbor butcher? Or the valiant dark defender? Only time will tell. Funny thing is, I've met someone who doesn't care what I am. I suppose every hero needs a sidekick. 
every villain a partner in crime? All my relationships have been built on not knowing, but that may be changing. Imagine that, a life with no more secrets. So, any new leads on the real guy? Not yet. We're hoping the cameras will turn something up. Cameras? In the marinas. Put them in a couple of days ago to monitor for suspicious activities. Good news for all those cops who keep boats at Coral Cove. You've got one too, right? Yeah. Yeah, we've been needing a security upgrade for a long time now. Has Lundy seen me on the tape? Is that why he invited me along today? To mess with me? That's my marina. And in less than 30 minutes, I'll be on that screen. I need to take care of this and fast. I'm out of time. I need an idea, a sign, anything. What would the old Dexter do? Definitely not that. No security cameras. Apparently the new Dexter is stuck in high school. Maybe I am a late bloomer. Take out my hose. <laughs> like it never happened. If only the rest of life were so easy to figure out. What is it? Crime scene. Crime scene? Are you? A police officer? Baywater Marina Warehouse 12, isn't it? Here. Shit, somebody did see you. Oh, fuck. No, we still have time. Patrol can't move until a homicide arrives on the scene. That's at least 15 minutes from now. How long have you been a cop? I'm not a cop. Well, what are you? Complicated. This way. Hurry up. About time. Come on. Hooker called in some gunshots, but didn't actually see the shooter. Well, where's the body? Well, haven't found it yet. Then what are we doing here? Hey. Blood. Bullet holes. Lots of blood. A significant amount of blood. Definitely some sort of homicidal situation here. A homicidal situation requires a body. Why don't we let the EMTs handle it? Your average person won't survive this amount of blood loss. There. That blood trail there. See it? Good chance that trail ends at a dead body. Dex is en route, but... I get it. We can't wait. Will you two guys follow us in in case this bleeder's alive?
Yeah. Hey, Fakwad, you taking the scenic route? Sorry, I was uh, with Harrison. <laughs> Said his first words. <laughs> bye bye. Yeah, that's sweet. Yeah, it was. I remember your first words. Shoes. You were very girly once upon a time. That's funny, because I always remember my first words as being hurry the fuck up. Almost there. Masuka and I tracked this dude's blood to a payphone inside a warehouse. You did? I think this way. Yeah, we're going to keep going to find us. Will do. Who the hell is that? Go. Now. Go! Compartmentalization is a joke. Fires rip through buildings all the time, no matter how closed off parts of them are. Is that? Dexter's car. Dexter. You will not believe what I found. What in the mother of fuck went on in here? I don't know exactly what happened. Two words, autoerotic mummification. Captain. Dexter. What are you doing here? It might be best if you take Harrison to another room. Because? Because I'm placing you under arrest for the murder of Hector Estrada. Dexter? Uh, Maria. This has to be some sort of mistake. I wish it was. Who the hell is Hector Estrada? You stay back. You get man, your hands off of me. Back. Jamie, just take Harrison to his room. Please, it's OK. I'm calling Deb. Dexter Morgan. You have the right to remain silent. Anything you say or do can be used against you in a court of law. You have the right to an attorney. If you cannot afford an attorney, one will be provided for you. Just so we're clear then, your official statement is that you went fishing last night and then went straight home to be with your son. I didn't kill Hector Estrada. No. You didn't cut his body into pieces and put it into bags, take it on your boat, and then throw it into the ocean? Why would I do that? Because Hector Estrada butchered your mother in front of you. So how about you start telling me the truth? I'm not the Bay Harbor butcher. He's answered all of your questions. You got nothing here, Maria. Not all my questions. These are from my phone last night, and that's you carrying plastic garbage bags onto your boat. It was ice to keep any fish I caught cold. My cooler broke. But earlier today, you said you didn't catch anything. What was in the bag? It was a shirt with Hector Estrada's blood on it and his wallet. You killed him. You killed him like you killed all your other victims. Admit it. You're the Bay Harbor Butcher. Dexter, don't say another word. That's enough, Sergeant. I was throwing away my dinner. It's a bag from Franco's. You can check. Angel, you gotta believe me. You frame jokes. After I defended you against him, you betrayed me, this department, everybody around you. Is that what this is about? Your desperate need to believe the James Dokes you knew or thought you knew wasn't a cold-blooded killer. You don't have the right to speak his name. 
You're so hurt, angry, scared. He's dead because of you. You were his partner, his lieutenant, his lover. But if you couldn't see what was right in front of your eyes, what does that say about you? I swear to God, Dexter, I'm going to nail you to the wall for what you've done. Maria. To the wall. Maria, that's enough. Come on, damn it. Lieutenant, you can't be in here. Tell them what you just told me. I reran the blood on the shirt that Captain LaGuardia discovered in the trash. <clears throat> it's definitely Hector Estrada's, but after going over it, I found an evidence number. What, what evidence number? The shirt you gave me with Estrada's blood on it is the shirt he was wearing the day he was brought in, back in 73. Things got a little rough, and the arresting officers broke his nose. That's impossible. I checked inventory. The shirt's missing. What about his wallet? Please don't kill the messenger. There was a partial print, and it's yours. Are you trying to frame my brother? Dead. You son of a bitch. You set me up. Maria, can I go now? Yes, you can. He did this. He is the Bay Harbor butcher. He has to be. This witch hunt of yours is fucking over. And if you have a problem with it, Captain, we can take it upstairs. 